I don't want to. There has been enough pain. I don't want to do this. Say what? Officer. Too late. You ruined it. Just say it now. Excuse me? What? What did you say? She's in pain. She's in so much pain. And so are you. Your chest is burning. We are very sorry to inform you, but your husband, Victor Méjean, was found dead this morning on the Martinez boardwalk. Oh. Oh. But he was just... He was just here. Alive. I understand that this comes as a huge shock. I want you to know that me and my partner are here for you if you have any questions. We are very sorry for your loss, ma'am. What happened to him? Tell me! And you just... found him there? Lying in the cold? How long had he been there? She doesn't reply. Her eyes well up with tears as she struggles to keep it together. You hear the clock ticking in the children's room. Is there anyone we could call for you? A friend, a family member, someone who could be here for you? No, no. I just need to tell my girls. It burns like acid. God, should I call them? Should I tell them to come home? All right, I'll call them. Just tell me, what do I need to do next? Where is he? Can I see him? And who should I contact? He was taken to the city morgue. The local coroner will be contacting you shortly to arrange the funeral. Here's his number, in case you want to contact him earlier. Is there anything else that the RCM could do for you? No, I'll call you if something comes up. I'm still a bit... a brain condition. Yes, you're a total fucking horror show. No, no, stop now. Again, if there's anything we could do for you, then don't hesitate to call the RCM, ma'am. She just nods, distant and inconsolable. The bed springs rattle beneath her as she begins to shake. These are her last reserves of strength. Her muscles will give in soon to a scream. I'll take it from here. Thank you. We should step outside and talk. So, the death notification. He's avoiding your gaze. This is the time to say how sorry you are about how things went. It's all right. Don't worry about it. I'll call the station when we're finished with the day and let them know the name of the deceased. That's it. We should get back to our case. There's nothing more we can do here. There's not much we can do for them anymore, I'm afraid. They have to. It's not your place to live their lives. And, officer, I've seen worse. This wasn't the worst I've seen, okay? Now let's go. I really have, he thinks. She was strong. She made it easy for us. <laughs> 